Good morning. Flippin' physics. Let's talk about terminal voltage. Terminal voltage, delta V sub T, is the measured voltage across the terminals of the battery. Oh, oh, and that is different from the electromotive force because EMF is the ideal electric potential difference across a battery. Correct, Billy. All real batteries have some internal resistance such that when a battery is supplying current to a circuit, the voltage measure, measured across the terminals of the battery, the terminal voltage, is less than the EMF of the battery. Typically, the symbol for the internal resistance of a battery is a lowercase r, and one way to illustrate a real battery in a circuit is by combining an EMF with a resistor and putting a box around that combination. In this circuit, the real battery is highlighted in yellow. The terminal voltage across the battery equals the EMF of the battery minus the electric potential difference across the internal resistance of the battery. We subtract the electric potential difference across the internal resistance of the battery because electric potential difference goes down in the direction of the current. We already showed that electric potential difference equals current times resistance. Therefore, the terminal voltage across a battery equals the EMF of the battery minus current through the battery times the internal resistance of the battery. Notice this means that as the current through a battery increases, the terminal voltage across the battery decreases. And the only way to get terminal voltage to equal EMF is to have zero current flowing through a battery. That does okay. not really make sense. Sure. I agree. Because that means the only time a real battery has the same voltage as its equivalent ideal battery is when the battery is not in an electric circuit. Thank you very much for learning with me today. I enjoy learning with you.